The course and the Glee Club have been front and center in virtually every major event of the university, every commencement, every convocation, every inauguration of a new president, and the big commemorations like the sesquicentennial celebration last year. We take great joy in representing Cornell's student body uh, at those big occasions, but also representing Cornell every year with our domestic tours. So the chorus and the Glee Club go on tour every year. Usually they're domestic tours, but this is a special year where we'll get to tour internationally. The chorus and the Glee Club have a very long history of wonderful international tours throughout the decades. And it's amazing to see alumni from those tours come back and talk about how these tours really were life-changing experiences. When I was a freshman, we had the opportunity to go to Brazil uh, spring my freshman year, which was an amazing experience, musically, culturally, personally, and uh, to be able to have that opportunity to travel internationally uh, as a freshman, I think really impacted the rest of my Cornell career. I have so many wonderful memories about uh, tour from a musical perspective, it gives, it gives the group an opportunity to really congeal and to move forward in a direction that is much more that can be achieved than when you're on campus doing twice weekly rehearsals. When you're on tour, you're traveling on a bus together, you're staying in homestays together, you're getting through travel experiences together, you, you're trying to solve problems that might come up when snafus happen, and you're doing that all together as, an, as a group, and it really bonds the group together. So we'll begin our Mesoamerica tour in Antigua, Guatemala, where we'll have a wonderful opportunity to perform and put on workshops for local schools and the community of the area. We'll also have concerts in these wonderful historic churches. Um, in addition, as we make our way up the Gulf Coast of Mexico, we'll have many concerts along the way, um, and a special stop in Mexico City where we will formalize the official Cornell Club of Mexico while we're there and get to engage with so many wonderful alumni who may be very far from the hill, but still have a connection um, to their time at Cornell and hopefully to current undergraduates. And we'll end the tour in Jalapa, Mexico with a special collaboration with the Jalapa Symphony Orchestra. Um, and with the Jalapa Symphony Orchestra, uh, we'll perform Cantares, a piece that we premiered last year at Carnegie Hall and was written by Cornell professor Roberto Sierra. When I, when I think of the tour, I, I think how exciting. I think it's a, it's, it's a project that, that speaks of our university. I, I think it's a project that shows really how, how powerful we are as an institution. The fact that there is a piece of music that was done recently at Carnegie Hall, that the chorus was a chorus of our students, written by a professor teaching here. I think that, as they say, you cannot beat that. I mean, that's a very powerful message. So it's in a way cultural diplomacy, not, not only for, for, the, for us as, as Americans, but also even more local for the institution. These groups really serve as global ambassadors for our alma mater. And they meet with alumni around the world. They meet with people who, who maybe have never heard of Cornell. And uh, I think it's wonderful that they present such a, a great face for the university to, to communities all over. I think that representing Cornell as an institution is really important to what we do. Um, and all the things that we've done that I've participated in so far have really shown me that um, there's a lot more to the organization than just what's going on today because there's such a rich history and I think there's a really bright future ahead. The Chorus and Glee Club has grown so much since I was a student, both musically but also from a leadership perspective and from an organizational perspective. These tours are fully student planned. They are fully student run and organized and that is that is second to none in tour experiences in the collegiate level um, in the United States. So, as you can imagine, in bringing over 100 Cornell students to Mexico and Guatemala, the costs are pretty significant. And as a student organization, we have an obligation to make sure that all of our members, regardless of their financial backgrounds, can afford this experience and share this tour with us. Um, so we hope that as alumni and parents and friends and fans of the Chorus and Glee Club, you can help provide this life-changing experience for many of our members and many of our students.